Okay, so I finally got around to watching Squid Game, the uh, Netflix series. It just uh, took the world by storm and uh, everyone was talking about it and I sort of thought, oh, I better watch it. So I, I did a binge watch over the weekend and absolutely brilliant series. Um, and very, there's a lot of hidden meanings in there and uh, one of the, one of the um, hidden things in there is I believe it's quite satanic. And you sort of think, oh God, Morris Wright, are you crazy? But let's have a look. There's some obvious ones, and there's a subtle one that I don't think anyone's actually uh, pointed out. So let's have a look here. So the more obvious one is, uh, I'll, I'll just call them by the player names. So player 244 is the Korean pastor. And um, he was always getting mocked for, you know, saying his prayers and so forth. So you can see here when they were doing the glass walk. Uh, so spoiler alerts, of course, here. You know, if you haven't seen it, don't <laughs> click off somewhere else because... Uh, there's going to be a few spoilers here, and I'll, you know, I'll sort of reveal some of the plot. So, you know, he was he was always um, getting getting uh, harassed for praying all the time. He was being called, you know, stupid. What's this nonsense? So, you know, this is, this should be a respected pastor, you know, one of the respected people in the community. He just keeps getting mocked because he you know, believes in God and Christ and that sort of thing. So, so you can see the player there. Uh, he's um, saying, you know, stop this nonsense, you know, get up. And uh, <laughs> then he actually physically pushes him <laughs> pushes him off and uh, pushes him onto the glass and he falls to his death, uh, the usual. So he goes, step forward, you crazy jerk. You know, so he gets mocked. And then uh, right at the end of the movie as well, you'll see this scene where you've got um, this, you know, just <laughs> another caricature like the the guy that's um, preaching preaching about Jesus is is getting mocked. He just looks like a crazy person, you know. Look at look at the the face on him there. And uh, one thing that's very interesting, I've only seen this. I think it was they did it when uh, when the uh, police officer was looking for his brother, and he went into his brother's room, and they come up with a tit like the big bold titles there. So it's not the subtitles, this is actually uh, something that should catch your attention. So it had their Believe in Jesus, and I thought that was quite strange as well. So after they're mocking him, they've, they've put this Believe in Jesus on there across the screen. It happened, uh, when, as I said, when the police officer, was, when he was looking for his brother, and he goes into the, in his brother's um, uh, room, uh, apartment there, and uh, there's actually a... a uh, Another title that comes across screen referring to one of the books there, which I'll get into later on on another another one uh, another episode because um, it's not relevant here. Um, and then you'll see here all he does is he, he doesn't really help he doesn't really help uh, play a four five six he just he just takes off his uh, blindfold and just stares at him with his grin on his face and believe in Jesus. So there's that sort of mockery there of of Christianity. But the the one thing that uh, I came across that uh, nobody else, I've never seen it anywhere, I've, I've sort of was uh, getting interested in uh, Squid Game and uh, looking into a few little things that, um, that I thought was interesting. But um, this thing here, so actually we'll go, we'll go back to this window first because I'll explain what I'm getting at. So if you've noticed... All the cars have the same number plate. As you can see here, the number plate is 747278, right? And if you don't believe me, this is the, the police officer here. Uh, he's on the ferry of all the uh, Hyundai, we call them IMAXs, uh, Hyundai model of van. And um, if you see here, uh, they've all got the same number plate, 747278. So he's on that, he's just hiding behind the van on the left there. And then he moves across the one on the right, same number plate, 747278. And that piqued my interest because, like, well, hang on a minute, why have they all got the same, they've all got the same number plate? This is crazy. So I started looking into the number plates, and I'll just show you an article here. So, what are the number plates on the Hyundai vans and Squid Game mean? And basically, they just sort of brushed over. So that's the scene there of them on the ferry, and um, they're saying that the the first uh, two numbers, seventy four, refers to the actual um, type of vehicle. So let's have a look here. So the symbol, uh, there we go, 
and in terms of sweet names, first two digits, 74, signify type of vehicle of number 70 to 79 applied to vans, coaches, and minibuses. This checks out for eight-seater Hyundai. All right, the symbol between the numbers, written in the Korean Hangul alphabet, means deo or more. However, it's just one of the 32 prefix symbols used to denote a car with a private registration. And it says higher cars, commercial and government vehicles all have their specific Hangul prefix. So that sounds pretty cool. You know, you sort of think, ah, oh, there's nothing to this. But I, I don't leave things. I don't leave things alone, do I? I sort of dig a bit more than most people. And they're saying the final four digits, 7278, is simply the car's registration number, as far as we can understand, offer no further significance. Ah, but Walrus Rider here has found some significance in those last four numbers and also the entire number plate. So just remember the number plate is 747278. So if you go to this website here and put in the color for 747278, you can actually see the color there is the gray color of the van. But the interesting is, thing is here, you can see that the web safe color is 666. 666. I kid you not. <laughs> put it in yourself. This is what the web safe when you convert the color to web safe, the van color, it comes up with 666, 666. It is the Antichrist, the number of the beast, 666. And then 666 again, just to make sure that you got the message to put it in twice. So there we go, guys. I thought I'd have that fun little video there for you. You two, uh, all the fans of uh, Squid Game, I don't think, uh, I haven't seen anyone point that out before, so. Uh, not only are there satanic references throughout the film and anti-Christ and that sort of thing, it's very anti-Christian, but um, the colour of the van, uh, uh, the number plate uh, refers to the colour of the van also, when you convert it to web safe, it comes out with the uh, number of the beast twice. So there we go, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed that one. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.